Hey everybody, John Ramdean and Robin Black with you. The UFC returns to network television. One of the pound for pound best fighters in action. April 15th, Demetrius Johnson looking to defend his title when he takes on the jiu-jitsu guy, uh, Dominic Cruz's teammate, Wilson Hayes, the former Elite XC champion. Uh, one of the things we know is if Wilson Hayes can somehow, some way, find his way to Demetrius yeah. uh, Johnson's back, he'll have a lot of success. Or will he? I, I, I don't know that there's too many people that can stop him in that area. And, and you're not going to beat Demetrius. We'll, we're going to talk about this. We'll, we'll go into some deep. I mean, you can talk forever about how, how good Demetrius is, how unbelievably developed he is as a combat artist. Um, but you, you're not going to beat him by being a little bit better in a couple places or being really well-rounded or with a game plan or you're, you're going to beat him with specialization if you're going to beat him. And that's why Wilson Hayes is a real test by being a specialist. He, so if he's on your back, you're in a lot of trouble and that will apply to everyone, including the great Demetrius Johnson. But he also has so many ways to get to your back. So if I was the best in the world at, at, at choking people and being on their back, but I had no way to get there. Be like, ah, shucks, if I could only get to his back, I could show you what I could do. But he's really good at getting to your back, taking your back, forcing you to react, and you give him different doorways in your reactions, which is the, the root of all of Demetrius's game, is if I grab your hand here, I know you're gonna pull it away in a yeah. particular way, and when you do, yeah. I do another thing. And you only have two or three choices in how you react, and he has an answer for all of them. And he'll beat you everywhere, and he'll beat Wilson Hayes with that game. Wilson has that for accessing the back. Whatever you do tends to uh, create a reaction, all of which are wrong and give him different ways to your back. So he is a specialist and he has the, the ability to choke Demetrius Johnson and win the title. One of the things uh, you pointed out to me and to, to the viewers, uh, it's just like Conor McGregor where his left hand is his weapon of choice. Mm -hmm. You're going down. Make sure you get everything to yeah. go to that, to that left hand. Wilson Hayes, it's the same yep. thing. Make sure all of the choices will lead yeah. to him trying to get Demetrius Johnson's back, no matter what. That would be, is that assignment one, two, yeah. three, four, and five? Yes. And if I'm, the only way that my other assignments will pop open is if I show DJ that it is absolute business, that he puts 100% focus on the on the preventing of that. So we either got to get there early, have him experience it, have him feel the realities of how good we are in this area and make that real to him. So when he stays hyper focused on stopping my path, if I'm Wilson, stopping my path to his back, that might allow option D, E, F to happen by distracting him and undermining his focus on my other things might line up my punch. Uh, hard to do for sure. Um, and it, it, it does, as you think it out, it really is a factor for, for Mighty Mouse to not overly focus on the, that particular danger, not just because that can be a distraction, but it can remove your focus from the big picture. And DJ's a big picture guy. And that's why I feel that it, it almost won't be an issue because Matt will have him so programmed that it's not really a thing. We've dealt with this a zillion mm -hmm. times before. Many masters, you've, you've, mm -hmm. you've worked with them. Don't make it about that. Make it about yeah. your thing. And, you know, when it comes to Wilson Hayes, yes, I can do that against, you know, number two guy in the division, three, four, five. Now you're facing arguably the pound for pound greatest fighter to ever step mm -hmm. foot in the cage who also can bring things to the table that you've never seen before. It's true. It's true. Uh, whenever Demetrius fights, it's a really uh, special moment to see the future um, and the future of how fighting is done. And the big picture future. And, and that, that is the thing. It's like he just creates a spider web of things and you get lost. And if you don't get lost and you're keeping up, eventually it deteriorates your ability to kind of stop him from opening all these things. It's, have you ever taken a dance uh, lesson or? Of course. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And you lead the dance. You lead the dance. Um, and what if your wife started leading it a different way? In the middle of it, yeah. you get chaos, yeah, yeah. right? And I'm uh, confused. Yeah. I just walk away. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> and that's what DJ's doing. He's your wife. Uh, and DJ's your wife, I think. That, no. That's not quite right. I, um, he would make me his wife. That's, that's, <laughs> if in jail, he's he, he, you're just, his wife. That's the reality. That is, that is the reality. I can do it. I there is nothing down. you could do about it. <laughs> and that applies to every one of you. 
260 pound guys yeah. who are like, oh man, that guy's little. You're delusional. He would make you he, his he, wife he just, also. He would just get so smashed. Yeah. And you'd eventually just have to enjoy whatever it is. He's <laughs> you don't have to enjoy it. You can, <laughs> you can cry, uh, but there's nothing you could do about it. Um, he is the best fighter in the world. Um, he and Matt you're, is very much the leader. And that's why their relationship is so good. And that's one of the reasons why he is the fighter right now is because he understands that he has access. It's like, you know, where the, the brain is in the Firestorm. Operating. That, you know that yeah. uh, superhero, yeah. DC superhero, it's stupid, the scientist yeah. and the, the teenager, exactly. and they become one yeah. person. And that's, 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 it. That's, the, that's the symbiotic deal of Matt and Demetrius Johnson. It's true. He understands fully that he has a a martial arts genius with a lifetime of study that is not plateau. When he plateaus, he finds new ways to keep growing. That's and Matt will cool. do that forever. And Demetrius will do that forever. But he needs to be in the right state of performance. He has been in every one of his last fights. But if he makes a mistake uh, and he's got this guy on his back, he can't panic. He can't overreact. We've never seen him do that anyways. But it's something to be Tim aware Elliott of. controlled him on the ground. Yeah. True. And, and that's the thing. It's just like, all right, that's what happens in a fight. Sometimes people take you down. I still got four more rounds, yeah. and I'm going to win those yeah. four, four rounds. Yeah. You imagine how much, like, uh, on the commentary on that show, uh, who, I forget who it was. I don't know if it was Brian. I just remember the commentary and how it was. I don't remember the, the voice. And then the talk the next day and all the social media interactions, people were just like, wow. what!" A, and um, Tim Elliott did have a great performance. Yeah. But we were so worked up. And so, like, thrilled because he won a round. Mm -hmm. He won a round. Yeah. A round. A round. One round. Uh, yes, totally. But one round. it's against the, the pound for pound. Back yes. Fighter. And I'm not undermining it. Yeah. Tim Elliott had a brilliant performance. But for us to see the best fighter in the world and see him lose a round, and we were shocked, that tells you where we yeah. understand where Demetrius yeah. Johnson sure. is. But I you guess what the bigger picture is when you're saying one round, it's like, when Demetrius and Matt approaches the fight, it's like, well, the, the fight isn't one round. No. The fight is 25 yeah. minutes, and that's what we've planned for, to win over the course of 25 minutes. If we can knock you out in the first round, great. If we can submit you at 4.59 of round we'll five, it. we'll do that. But over the bulk of those scheduled 25 yeah. minutes, we are yeah. going to beat you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you're going to be my prison yeah. wife. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, and uh, speaking of the greatest of all time, uh, I, I was talking to Pat Cote uh, on his podcast, and we were talking about George coming back. And if you're George and Demetrius, they're, they're similar in their dominance in their eras. You're George coming back. You actually prioritize taking no damage, learning, getting comfortable, and being defensively sound in round one. Like, you don't give it away, but it, you don't go after it. You don't need round one. George versus Mike right, or right, George right. in any return fight. And that's true of any dominant champion. If the value of experiencing round one the way that we do results with me knowing more at the end of it than you know, it's more valuable. It's more valuable. Um, but that's not what happened. Tim took that round from him and he should be commended. And I hope it's not misunderstood that I'm undermining that. I'm just saying that to see somebody take a round from him and see us all be stunned and blown away is just telling you how highly ranked, rated, and considered this genius of fighting is by anybody in the know. Uh, if you're Wilson Hayes, it can't be just trying to get to the back. You're trying to convince Demetrius Johnson that you're going to stand, that you're going to throw punches, that you're going to put other things out there to disguise mm -hmm. him trying to to get to the back of Demetrius Johnson. Uh, how does he ensure that? There, you know, there was the simple thinking. It's so much more interesting and complicated than this now, only 10 years later. But the simple thinking was, and, you know, Johnny Hendricks, when he was coming up about to face George, uh, everybody was concerned with my takedown, and then I started landing left hands. And then now I can fake the left hand, and it'll give me a takedown. That is not, it's way, that doesn't work anymore. That simplistic approach to it doesn't work for most people, I should say. It, um, but what does is within those, we have broken that macro down into lots of micro. So I come in, and let's say um, uh, Wilson ha comes in off a single, very common, and people don't get a lot of singles anymore, but I come in off a single leg, and in getting it, I reach for your far hip, and in getting that, that allows me access to your back. So, 
and I do that, maybe I get to your back, maybe you stop me, but it's a lot of work for you. In that moment, I'll make you react to that, and then there's a little shot in there. So th we have taken the same principle, but instead of saying my punch versus my takedown, it is within the details and the minutia of the details do of damage. those things. I will do damage when I get you to react to my hand on the far hip. As you rotate to get back there, I'll go elbow. So there's little entry points that if he uses them, but much like jujitsu, and anybody who's done any, when you, when you go uh, and you go to do a Kimura on me, and then I react, and then you try to, to guillotine yep. me, and I react, and then you sweep me. Those three things are sub three of the very earliest things you'll learn in a lot of jujitsu. Uh, and people will say, okay, I'm going to fake this to get that. You have to really go yeah, for yeah, this. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you really, you really go for you don't just have to convince them. You have to really be doing right, it. Right, right. It's not, if I'm convincing you, I'm still lying. You're I'm pulling faking. I'm it. pulling back. If I commit to it, then the reaction opens up, and I Because it's a real reaction. It's a real reaction to a real threat. And... And if we get Wilson Hayes at a state where the, the small threats, the micro threats of accessing the back are real, we get micro moments to do damage in there. And so that I think is there, but we're, we got to, um, to slice this thinly if we're going to find ways to try to beat Demetrius Johnson. You're, you just have to. There's no other answer. Or we can say, well, you know, anything can happen in a fight, and if you land your big punch. We all know that. That is that is always true even against the best guys in the world, which is why they have to be hyper-focused. Even John Jones or Demetrius Johnson has to be in their state of optimum performance. Will Wilson Hayes be the man to defeat the pound for pound best Demetrius Johnson. Don't All the bet action on it. goes down April 15th on network TV.